thank you for watching. Today what we're going to do is we're going to show you guys how to install and clean up your system using CCleaner. CCleaner is a great utility uh, that we use to optimize your system. Uh, you can clean your registry with it, you can clean up some temporary files, clean up your web browsers. Um, you can also do some other things with it like uh, uninstall software. Uh, there's many uses for this software. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and show you how to install it and uh, clean up your system with it. Now if you've downloaded it using the links on the side of the of the blog or if you've gone to the CCleaner website and downloaded it, it's going to download into your downloads folder. Um, all you have to do is go in there and double click it and we'll start the installation. Now there will be another video that I'm going to release. Um, I recommend using this uh, CCleaner along with TuneUp Utilities. Um, when it gets to this point it's going to ask you if you want to install Google Chrome and also install the uh, toolbar. I don't want either of these installed so I'm going to uncheck them and then click install. Um, but yeah we recommend using it with uh, TuneUp Utilities. There will be another video on how to uh, install and clean up your system using TuneUp Utilities uh, to get the best performance out of your computer and have it running the best. Um, so there, yeah, we're going to go ahead and uh, make another video on that. Be sure to keep an eye out for it. Now CCleaner and uh, TuneUp Utilities are both um, free. Uh, TuneUp Utilities has a free 15-day trial, which is it's a fully functional 15-day trial. Um, that's all we're going to show you how to use when we actually get to that. CCleaner is, uh, is free as well. You can download it and use it as long as you like. Uh, I usually uncheck uh, View Release Notes because I don't really care to read them and then click Finish. It's going to ask you to intelligently scan for cookies to keep. Click yes. This will take a moment to, uh, to detect the cookies. Alright, now here is what CCleaner looks like. Now there are all kinds of different things that you can do with it. I'm just going to show you some of the basic things that we're going to do to uh, get your computer running better if you're having some problems with it. Um, first thing is it's always going to be start out with uh, this cleaner is going to be checked. Uh, once that once this window comes up, all you have to do is click on Run Cleaner, and it's going and then you're going to see this. Uh, this process will permanently delete files from your system. Are you sure you want to proceed? I click uh, Do Not Show Me This Again and click OK. And what it's doing now is it's scanning uh, different areas of your computer for temp files and stuff like that uh, that just don't need to be there that are taking up space on your computer and probably slowing things down a bit. So this will just take a few minutes to scan your system. starting to show some progress. Now 
this could go a little bit faster depending on your computer. It uh, depends on what every individual computer is going to have going on with it. Could go fast or could take longer. But uh, this will definitely clean up the stuff on your computer. Once it's complete, I usually recommend running the cleaner one more time. This is just to make sure that it got everything. And this process, uh, running it again, will uh, usually go by a little bit faster. And there it is. Okay, and now the next step is to click on the registry part over here. All right, and then we're going to click Scan for Issues. And it'll start uh, looking for any type of registry problems. Now, CCleaner is a good free utility, but it doesn't get everything. This is one of the reasons why we recommend using tune-up utilities after you've finished with um, CCleaner. So look up, keep an eye out for the video on how to clean your system with tune-up utilities. All right, after it's finished scanning, we're going to click on Fix Selected Issues. You're going to click on No. Then you're going to click on Fix All Selected Issues. And then Close. And we're going to scan it one more time. Just to make sure that everything was clean. All right, no issues were found. That's good. Now there are a couple other things that you can use uh, CCleaner for. Uh, you can uninstall software, you can uh, adjust startup uh, programs, stuff like that. Uh, but we're not going to get with any of this right now. Um, the only thing that we're going to show you how to do is run the main cleaner and the registry. Those are really the only two things that you need to worry about with it right now. All the other stuff we're going to show you how to do later. Uh, we're just trying to show you how to fix some basic issues with your computer, which is clicking on uh, the cleaner here and also running the registry cleaner. And that is it. That is how to clean up your system with uh, CCleaner. Now, if you're only cleaning this up one time, we also recommend that you uninstall it from your system um, once you're finished with it. And uh, that way it's not taking up space on your computer. All right. Thank you for watching.